Yeah. <laughs> it's amazing what you can do though with like a thousand bucks now. Yeah. yeah. Like compared to call it fifteen years ago, like a thousand bucks got you like a crappy, crappy camera, yeah. no video. Yeah. Now I, it's yeah. phenomenal. So um, what brings you to the key? Just curious. Uh, just checking out the sites today. I had an appointment in the area and I've got a little bit of time before my next appointment this afternoon. So I thought I'd come down here and see the artwork and the view. Uh, do you come here very often? Or? No, not at all. Uh, second or third time here. Did you ever think it's pronounced Quay like I did? <laughs> you know what? At one time I did. It's like, what the heck is the Quay? I, I don't know what... What is this? I had to talk to people. Like, I only lived here for about four years. So it was... Yeah, I felt like a fool or an idiot, but I figured it out eventually. Particularly a sunny day, but like, do, do, does it matter to you that the weather's nice for you to come out, or do you come out every way? Like, for some reason, it matters to me. It took a lot of motivation for me to come out today. It was the sun helps me, but when it's like this, mm -mm. but today I just felt like I wanted to help out my mom. وقتی که باید خوبه اون وقتا میانی همیشه میانی فرق نمیشه اکسر همون میانی آره جای خوبیه بیوه قشنگی داره داره آرومه دیگه آرومش بگیره ببخشی فارسی من خوب میشه نه اینجا بگیره anyway so what else you want to talk to me about just a few things for one um, we're curious why you're at the key right now or um, I actually have friends who have the Celtic store where did I put their cards um, and um, Every time I need uh, a new bagpipe bag, I can get it. I, I don't mean the bag that holds the air, the cover for it. Okay. Um, or if I need a new kilt, or a Balmoral, or a Tema Center, or some other things, or some jewelry, I go there if they want anything that's Celtic, Irish or Scottish. You see, my mother's maiden name is Hogan. She's from County Cork, she's red-headed, She's about her size, and I am not joking, my father was terrified of the woman whenever she got ticked off. Never piss off a red-headed woman, especially if she's Irish. Okay, let's get it up. Uh, okay, unfortunately, we seem to be cursed, well, we seem to be attracted, the males of my family tend to be attracted to red-headed women. We should know better by now. <laughs> Did I say that out loud? Oops. So I grew up speaking Irish Gaelic and Scottish Gaelic. Okay, the two Gaelics. By the way, something you may not know. Gaelic is not European, it's Asian. Okay. The chanter on the bagpipe, both Irish and Scottish, and most of the bagpipes on the planet, do not use a do-re-mi scale. They use an Asian scale. A friend of mine who's an anthropologist has traced the bagpipes to the end of this valley about 5,000 years ago. The chanter part of the bagpipe can be found in most Indian subcontinent of India instruments, same notation. Even the drums for them are Asian notation, not European. A lot of people don't know that. I had no idea. Mm. In India, at one time, there was 
there's a caste called Brahmin, which are considered very high caste. There was a caste above them at one point. They were called, I'll now say it in Hindu and then explain what it is. They called them Kshatriya. Okay? It means warrior, priest. Okay. By the way, do you know what MacLeod means in Scottish Gaelic? Mac, meaning son, son or of. son of, right? Mac. Leod, proper pronunciation in Gaelic, is the Gaelic word for ugly. I'm son of ugly. And of course, what's my grandfather named me? After him, because I was born on his birthday. Duncan. Well, Duncan is a little blue-haired demon that stands about this high. Okay? So I'm in the son of an ugly, I can't bloody win. I'm gonna be 